Hi guys and welcome back to Car Focused. In today's video, um, I'm doing a bit of a product review. A couple of car cleaning products that have been sent out by a company called GT Shine. Now, I don't normally do these kind of videos. I do get a few companies approaching me with products and asking if I can try them for the channel. And nine times out of 10, the products I'm not really interested in and I don't agree with reviewing products I'm not interested in for the sake of a video. But on this occasion, I was actually in need of a drying towel and I was looking for a drying towel and completely by coincidence, this company approached me and asked if I would like to try their new drying towel. Now the company is GT Shine, it's called a GT Twist drying towel and they reckon that you can dry your car to a streak free shine in under 90 seconds. So that's basically what we're gonna try and do today. I've got the Cooper out there, it hasn't been washed for ages, it's been so busy. So we're gonna give the Cooper a wash by the way, I need to give you an update video on the Cupra because I did a video a while back with some potential problems on the car that I had, but I need to do a video on that just to fill you in. But anyway, yeah, so we're gonna give this towel a try. Now they've also sent me out some quick ceramic spray. Now this stuff, loads of companies are knocking this stuff out now. It's basically like a rapid, um, a rapid wax kind of thing. So once you've washed the car and you're ready to dry it, you spray this on every panel when the car is wet and then you basically just dry the car as normal. Or you can dry the car and then buff it into the paintwork. So pretty straightforward stuff. It's basically a quick and easy ceramic coating. So it's not gonna be like a proper ceramic coating, but it'd be a temp more of a temporary measure. It seals and protects your paintwork from scratches, uh, bird droppings, bug splatter, water spots, and more. So we'll give that a try as well. So once we've dried it with this on, I'll then put a bit of water on the car just so you can see any beading effect it may have. Anyway, so this towel, yeah, it's nice and thick. It's pretty uh, pretty big in size as well. So yeah, it seems like quite good quality. So we'll see how we get on. So I'm gonna wash the car first and I'll come back to you once that's done. And then we'll see if we can get the car dry in 90 seconds or less. Because that's a bold statement. Anyway, we'll see. So I'm not gonna film washing the car. You've seen me wash the car before. I've done a Cooper washing video before anyway. So I'll catch up with you when the car is washed and we'll crack on with the drying towel. Right guys, so the car is clean. It's sunny, so it's not ideal. You're not supposed to put that ceramic spray on when it's sunny, but I'm gonna wet the car anyway. Very quickly put the spray on it and then we're gonna razz around the car and try and do it in 90 seconds. So this corner here, which is in the sun, it just keeps drying. And also, it's windy, which is annoying. So, get the towel and the spray. So I can spray. I spray the front of the car, and some shade. Spray the doors here, spray it on the roof. Very, very quickly, on the back of the car, and then I'm gonna do this bit here, around the side. Oh, this thing's going right over the place. Right, so, let's start the clock. One, two, three, go. Oh, right, I'm just gonna attack it as quickly as I can. Oh, he's doing a good job though. He's doing a very good job. 90 seconds though, that is, that is very hard. You're gonna hear a lot of panting from me. <laughs> 20 seconds. <laughs> I don't know if we're gonna succeed. Tell you what though, it's just soaking up this water. Soaking it up. 40 seconds. Oh God, I don't think we're gonna make it guys. I think you've gotta be an utter speed freak to do it in 90 seconds. 54 seconds, we've got 30 seconds. Can we do it? Can we do it? <laughs> Quickly get the back of the car. 25 seconds. We're not far off. We're not far off, guys. Quickly front bumper. Come on, it's 10 seconds. Five seconds. Quick wing mirror, and that's it. Wow, you know what? 
that's not far off. Whew, not far off, guys. Bar the odd, oh, I'm out of breath. But bar the odd drip here and there, that is pretty dry. It is quite smeary though. I am gonna have to buff this bit where it's been in the sun, where I sprayed that ceramic spray. As I say, it specifically says don't do it in the sun. But like I say, just need to give it a little buff. But uh, yeah, 90 seconds, smashed it out. Sorry about the heavy breathing, but uh, yeah, there we go. So guys, the car is done, we succeeded. We managed to get the, the car dry in 90 seconds. To be fair, the towel just totally mopped it up. And we used a ceramic spray, it wasn't ideal conditions, but it's on. I've given it a little buff off of a microfiber and it looks pretty good now. I've just got some water, just gonna pour it on and just see how it beads. Oh wow, beautiful. So I'd probably say that is better than some of the other spray waxes I've used. In fact, yeah, it's definitely better. It's almost dry after pouring it on. So yeah, for a quick spray and a dry of the towel, you can't really go wrong. And I'll probably apply that once a month or something, but it's gonna give you a little bit of protection, isn't it? It's gonna make cleaning the car that bit easier. So yeah, pretty good. So we have it guys, that's it. Quick product test of the GT Shine Quick Ceramic Spray and their twist drying towel. They claim you could do it in 90 seconds, we did it. The towel feels really heavy, it's absorbed loads of water. Pretty happy with the product actually. Would I buy it again? Yes, I would. Once I've found, some, once I've found something that I like in terms of car cleaning, I tend to buy it over and over again because I know it works. It just hoovered up the water, leaving no streaks, perfectly fine. Probably next time I'd probably use this separately so I'd probably dry the car with this towel, then use this and just buff it off each panel individually, just make it a bit easier. But if you wanna go grab one of these yourself, guys, please check out the link in the description box below. Um, so yeah, guys, feel free. Like I say, would I recommend it? Yes, I would recommend it. Go and give it a try, see what you think. You've seen the results for yourself. So yeah, anyway, guys, that's it. Until the next one, as always, take care and I shall see you soon.